all right beautiful people a quick look at this microphone which is the Sanko Mac M3 on camera shotgun condenser microphone a few months ago I reviewed one of their microphone which is the Sanko D30 on camera shotgun microphone and here I am again with this one uh, this is quite cheaper smaller than the D30 we are going to look at some quick specifications of this mic and we will do a sound check so you can tell if this mic suits or sounds good for you some quick specifications this mic is compatible with both cameras and smartphones runs on two AAA batteries and will give you up to 50 hours runtime or 10 hours if you should connect your headphone for monitoring it's super cardioid which means that pickup pattern is directional frequency range between 30 Hz and 20 kHz you get gain adjustments signal to noise ratio is 78 dB which is similar to what you get with the Rode Video Mac Pro what do I like about the design? it looks beautiful but it's made of plastic not metal like the D30 I reviewed earlier behind you get two outputs one mic out and the other one a headphone out for cameras like the Sony a6400 that is without a headphone port you do not have to worry so much since you can monitor your audio straight from this microphone on top you get two switches one is the power on switch which also serves as the low cut fitter switch and the other one your gain adjustment switch mind you this is not a stepless gain adjustment as you can only decrease your gain by minus 10 db or increase it to plus 10 db when review microphones i usually like to test them in the way they are made to be used and for on camera shotgun microphones like this one we mostly will use them for mobile vlogging so i'll go out right now and put this mic to test so we're outside testing this microphone it's kind of windy yes it's just finished raining and the environment is kind of noisy with uh, so many activities happening around so you can listen to the sound now and be able to tell if this mic works best for you when you are outside making content with this mic you should get a furry windscreen to be able to get rid of wind noise right now i don't have a furry windscreen that would perfectly fit this mag so I definitely should be getting one if I do intend to use this shotgun microphone for outdoor shoots signal to noise ratio is 78 db and understanding uh, signal to noise ratio the higher your number the better your mic would handle or isolate your voice from background noise and the self noise is minimal this mic is extremely lightweight which makes it a better option for me when working with the the Ukraine M2 or the Ronnie SC why the shock mount is beautifully designed it's more like a holder than actually doing the work of a shock mount this mic says for $59 which is less than half of the price of some other microphones with similar features from other competitors I recommend this mic if you're a content creator on a budget but if you have more to spare you may have to consider the Sanko D30 that says for $159 that sits in between compact on camera shotgun microphones and professional shotgun microphones over here at bts gram it's all about the process of filmmaking so if you like what we do please remember to hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up i'm director airman and until i come your way next time bye for now